Good morning, mighty men and women of God. Today is Thursday, July 2nd, 2020. When was the last time you had a return to the basic session with yourself? Sometimes it's easy to forget just how different and exclusive Christianity really is compared to the other religions of the world. In order to appreciate salvation, we must revisit the death of Jesus on the cross. This was a selfless act made available for each and every person who has ever lived from that time forward. Also, many times in conversations with others, we forget about the provision of redemption. This is provided through the finishing work of the resurrection of Jesus from death to life. And then there is also the exclusivity of absolute truth through faith in Jesus. So today, this morning's prayer reminds us of the exclusivity of Christianity to salvation, redemption, and truth. Father, the drawing of people to the cross is done through your Holy Spirit. May we always be in tune with his guidance. It's through the cross that the finished work of salvation is gained. Salvation is simply receiving your gift of grace, whose name is Jesus Christ, your only begotten Son. We will never be able to earn the right to be embraced by you because it's your gift to us. For those who are waiting until we are all right and all cleaned up, this is the absolute wrong way to do things. We can never cleanse ourselves enough. Father, we just need to come to you as dirty as we are, because only Jesus can cleanse us and present us to you. Redemption comes from the resurrection of Jesus from the dead to life. It is the finished work, for without his resurrection, your plan for humanity would be incomplete. This faith spoken of in your word is not just about forgiveness, but also redemption. This redemption comes through the grace of Jesus. All other religions talk about longing for it, hoping for it, but never any provision for it. Only through the crucifixion and resurrection of Jesus are we able to obtain your complete package. Father, through your timeless plan lies the very foundation of absolute truth, which is also exclusive to faith in Jesus Christ. Many will argue that there's just no difference in the religions of the world, saying all religions are fundamentally the same and superficially different. But the absolute truth of the matter is, all religions are fundamentally different and at best superficially similar. All religions claim exclusivity of truth, but only Christianity provides proof of exclusivity through the birth, life, death, and resurrection of your son, Jesus. Oh, Father, your offer is not hard to understand. It's available for everyone. So, who will accept your invitation? Certainly, Father, the choice is ours. Oh, Father, we praise you this morning, and we pray in the name of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. This is Jeff with this morning's prayer, praying that you have a great and God-filled day today. Shalom.